Hi everyone and welcome to your fat burner workout challenge. Please make sure you have some clear space around you, free from any trip hazards. Um, if you have your water bottle with you, then keep it close because you may need to reach for it between exercises. Let's get started. Starting this superset with some ballet calves raises. So these are calves raises with your heels together and your toes pointing out. And you can see that Coach Levi is using his arms for balance as well. And then just really lifting all the way up, putting your small paws at the top of it, and then coming back down until you've got flat feet. Then we're going to work some crisscross hops to create the cardio element of this exercise. So this is basically lunge hops and jumping jacks put together in sequence. Stay nice and light on the ball of your foot and just try and keep the same momentum throughout the set. Your turn to have a go. For the strength element of the superset, we're going to go into an isometric sumo squat. So this is a wide squat with your toes and knees pointing out. Now you can see we've got a nice 90 degree bend of the knees for this one. And just maintaining and holding the position throughout the set. Then we're going to switch it up and go some X mountain climbers. So these are mountain climbers with your knees 
pushing to the opposite elbow or outside of the opposite elbow, in fact. Now try and shoot those knees as far as you can and stay nice and light on your toes. Only one ball of the foot touching the ground at a time. So at no point should both of your feet be on the ground. Your turn to try this superset. <laughs> Starting this superset with an N sit. So it's basically like a Pilates V sit, but we're going to keep our knees bent on this one and really focus on trying to keep your weight on your butt cheeks and not on your tailbone. Keep your knees in place and keep your core engaged throughout the set until it's time to switch it up and work our pike pulses in that prone position. So with this one, we're just making sure that we're keeping our knees nice and straight. We're going to push our butt all the way up and then drop back down into a traditional plank position and just try and keep the momentum going on this one. Your turn to have a go at this superset.
starting this superset with an isometric glutes bridge. So we're basically picking our glutes bridge up, and then once we hit that straight line from the shoulder to the knee, or once you've got complete tension in your glutes and in your hamstrings, we want to just leave it up there without allowing our hips to drop. Now, a great little trick for this one is to push down with your heels, and that's going to help you elevate your hips some more. For the cardio exercise, we're going to work some push-ups with some knee strikes. So push up all the way down and then throw one of your knees all the way to your chest. And then on the next push-up, we're going to alternate legs. Now make sure that whilst you're in this prone position, you've got a straight line from your shoulder all the way to your ankle so that you're not dipping your hips and that you're protecting your back. Your turn to have a go at this superset. Starting this superset with some half rollovers. So you can see that coach Levi has his arms vertical pointing right up. And then he's bringing his shin all the way to his hands and then dropping the legs straight back down and stopping before his heels touch the ground. Now, 
If you're getting a little bit of trouble with your back or if you feel like you're arching your back up on this one, don't drop your heels down as much. So stop a little bit short. And then as you're lifting up, just make sure your shoulder blades and heads lifted to give you ample back protection. And then for the cardio exercise, let's work some squats with some side knee strikes in there. So you can see we're dropping nice and low into that squat. And then as we come up, we're throwing a knee strike outside of your elbow. So this is forcing you to use your obliques and use your intercostals. Your turn to try this combination for yourself. Side plank for the strength component of this superset. So you can see that I've got my feet stacked together and then just really trying to hold a straight body line. So straight line from my shoulders all the way to my ankles. And then another straight line from my elbow underneath me all the way to my hand at the top. Now if you have a lot of trouble with this particular exercise, you can bend the bottom leg and just place your weight on your knee instead. But this is a good fundamental strength exercise, so let's really try and hit the mark if we can. We're going to do both sides of it, and then we're going to get up and work some gentle burpees. 
Now, when you do your gentle burpees, there's no jumping involved. We're stepping back and stepping into it so that we're getting all the core engagement, but we're not getting any of the joint impact. And then when we come up, there's no jump at the end of it either. Now, you can increase the pace on this if you like to challenge yourself a little bit more. Your turn to have a go at this exercise. Well done for getting through today's workout. Be sure to spend a few minutes stretching and cooling your body back down. Comment and let us know what you thought of today's workout and be sure to tune in tomorrow to progress through to the next workout. See you soon. <laughs>